Hey guys, this is Chris with Affiliate Tube, and today I have an amazing product review to do for you that's coming out called JVZoo Member. And what this is, JVZoo Member is a product creation and membership site platform all in one uh, that doesn't require you to have any kind of technical skills to get it set up and to get it going and to start making sales really fast. And one of the best things about JVZoo Member is that there are no upsells. So what you buy with the initial upfront cost is what you get. There's no nothing else you need to get it working. Everything is included. Now, here's the catch to it. When this product first launches, it's going to be $47 a month. That's it. Now, every day, I believe that price is going to go up a little bit until it reaches $67 a month. So when it hits that point, it's not going back down. So if you decide to get JVZoo member, you need to get it fast. Um, there's also going to be an annual subscription, if you'd prefer that, where you can get it for $397 a month when it launches. And then after it launches, shortly after, it's going to go up to $497. So get it early. Now with JZ, JVZoo member, you're going to see here in just a minute exactly how it works inside the member area and a lot of the features that's included with it. But basically what you do is you log into your dashboard and you just simply add all of your products, your courses, your software, whatever it is you have um, within a dashboard, adjust a few settings and you're set up to go to start selling. Uh, everything you need is included with it. There's no additional purchases required to start making sales and it also has full reporting features. So what I'm going to do instead of just sitting here and talking to you and telling you how it works, here's a short video demo that takes you inside the dashboard and shows you exactly how many of the features work. When you log into JVZoo member, the first thing you're going to see is the dashboard. The dashboard will show all of the different memberships that you've created. It will allow you to create a new membership import a membership, and you can always look at the tutorials that are available as well. In fact, on most of the JVZoo member pages, you'll have individual training videos for that particular page, which will make sure that everybody knows how to use each and every tool as they go through the process. To create the new membership, hit the Create Membership button. This will allow you to give the membership a name, add a membership URL, a title, a description, and add an image for that membership. Going back to the main dashboard, you can see that under each of the membership sites, you have the ability to go to the campaign dashboard, to visit the site, to share on Facebook, to add tags, to clone the site, to add scripts, to turn the site on and off, and to delete the site. Below that, you'll have information on your members, as well as the money that you've made from that particular membership. On the campaign dashboard for your membership sites, you can see where your traffic is coming from at a glance. You can also change courses by using the button over here. And on the left hand side, you can start creating your course by going through the three steps, your course, pricing, and access emails. Across the top, you have your dashboard. You have the visit page button. You can also go to your membership pages. You can go to your sales pages and you can select your theme. To start off, we're going to go to the my courses area. By visiting step one, you can see all of the different courses within your membership. In this case, we have three. To add a new course, simply click the new course button or click the wizard button to be taken through step by step on creating the new course. At any time, you can delete all the courses by clicking the third button here. Down below, you'll see each of the courses that you've already created. To make any changes, such as changing the name, simply hit the pencil icon to edit those details. Once inside, you can change the title, the description, you can choose your instructors, you can also upload a new image as well as a course logo, and you can choose whether or not to disable the logo by clicking the button here. You can also choose whether or not to make this course public by simply turning the on off button. When you enable this, this product will be available to all members regardless of which level of your membership they've purchased. Down below, you can set whether or not this is a time-based course if you'd like to drip feed content, and you can add categories and tags to that particular course. And step two, you set your pricing options by choosing your course, and then hitting add option. This will allow you to give this option a name, such as gold membership, choose the course, add a title that gives information about this course, 
and a description. Once you're done, you simply hit save. In step three, you can set up your access emails by choosing your course and modifying any of the emails that you've set up previously. Clicking the access details will allow you to make modifications on the fly, or you can then hit update. To add or modify content to your courses, go back to the My Courses section. And then down below, you can add information by adding videos, importing videos, adding video lessons, adding content lessons, setting options, adding retargeting codes, adding related modules, deleting the course, activating and deactivating the course, viewing the course, importing a CSV, cloning a course, and drag course, which allows you to change the order in which your courses are laid out. To view the courses inside of a membership, click the arrow here. This will now show you each of the lessons that are included with this particular course, where you can go in and you can create descriptions, you can add resources, and you can add videos. You can also set options for this particular lesson, as well as add related page settings. Again, you can delete this particular lesson, activate it, view it, clone it, drip feed it, or drag this module up and down to reorder it with the other modules. To add your content, click the edit button here, and this will allow you to add any content that you need inside of your course. Once you're done, you can hit save changes and exit. You can add resources by clicking the middle button, and this will allow you to bring resources in through either an external URL or through downloadable content. Simply give the content a name and a description, and then you can add an external URL for people to access that particular content. You can also choose existing content from the library. To add a video, click the video button, and this will allow you to add videos in a variety of ways. You can choose any videos that are already uploaded with the video manager, or you can hit add new video. This will allow you to bring in content from YouTube, Vimeo, Wistia, Amazon S3, Dropbox, from a generic video file, and from HTML5. For YouTube, simply give it a title, add your tags, choose your video group, and then either add in the YouTube embed code or the YouTube URL. For any of the other video sources, fill in the information in the box provided. Once you're done, simply hit submit. Another thing that your customers will love about JVZoo Member is the ability to create all of your sales pages and funnel pages right from within the program. Simply click the sales page button, and this will bring up the sales funnel page. In here, you can choose your course. Then you can choose a theme from any of the six included themes. Once you have the theme you like, you can click on the sales page or the sales order form to make any changes. JVZoo Member uses an easy drag and drop system to create changes to the page. Simply scroll down the page to find anything that you'd like to make a change to, such as the text, and make your changes. To edit a button, click on the button, then you can change the call to action, and add a button link. You can also change colors by clicking on the color picker. Once you're done with any changes, simply hit the save button. For the sales order form, the same process exists. Use the drag and drop editor to make any changes to your sales form that you'd like. And so there's a brief demo inside of JVZoo Member. Now, if you want to learn more, you can visit their official website at jvzmember.com. The link's also directly under this video. If you're planning on having some kind of a membership platform where you want to sell stuff online, this would be the perfect solution to do it. Definitely one of the most affordable out there on the market right now, especially if you get in early and get it for $47 a month. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you did, please like this video, subscribe to my channel, click the little bell so you'll get notified of when I have future videos coming out.